in the new Toronto wanna be me a little. All your exes know I like my- I haven't done any talks like this in the past, but I just wanna say before you listen that I've dealt with what I'm talking about on both sides of the spectrum. The side where I messed up and on the side where I felt God's grace. I take this coming from a fellow human being and someone who wants to improve his life. Let's go. All right, this is Connor Sullivan, Connor Sullivan TV. I got a new message for you today. I just felt that this was Profound enough to share with you guys. I've been learning. Life is a continuous process of learning and relearning. The secret of being content. Contentness is something that brings peace. We're all searching for peace of mind. That is a fact. We're trying to find it in things that don't bring peace, and that's a problem. Paul the Apostle is in prison while he's writing this. He has learned the secret of being content in any and every situation, whether well-fed or hungry, whether living in plenty or in want. I can do everything through him who gives me strength. He is talking about Christ Jesus. Paul lost everything he's in prison for the sake of the Lord Jesus Christ, and he considers that greater than anything else you can gain in this world. We have to find that true peace, and the only way true peace comes is through Christ. I read this quote last week. It says, when you realize needing nothing attracts everything. When you go about your life in a way where you are focusing on what you have to focus on, then the things that you need tend to fall in line. Whoever finds his life will lose it, and whoever loses his life, for my sake, will find it. The flesh makes you think that you'll, you're going to find your own life life in things of this world, your sport or people that you know or your identity that this world gives you. If you find your life in this world, you're going to lose the purpose of why you're here. But if you lose your life for Christ, basically give up your life to Christ, you will find it. That peace that you get, the contentment that Paul had in prison, beyond my human understanding, the dude will give it to you. And I'm passionate about it because I've seen it work in my own life. Anytime you try to make it go your way, it's not work. How can you find contentness even more so? Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. Seek first his kingdom and his righteousness and all these things will be added on to you. They go hand in hand. Love the Lord your God with all your heart. If you're doing that, you're going to seek first his kingdom. If you seek first his kingdom, God will add everything that you need into your life. Every human is in the same playing field. There's God and there's everybody else. And as humans, every single day, we need to make sure we plug into the power source. God's the power source. That's it. Thanks for watching. And this is... Personal TV. Later, guys. All you boys in the new Toronto wanna be me a little. All your exes know I like my O's with a V in the middle.